<clears throat> Hi everyone, uh, this is Francisco, and the reason I'm recording this video is to talk about the mm, Teslas. Um, and smart cars and stuff like that and then um, there's also there's also something else um, oh yeah on YouTube <coughs> YouTube um, <coughs> Tesla Cam. Oh, wham bam Tesla cam. That's what it was. Wham. I think that's how you spell it. Wham bam Tesla cam. Well, so doesn't like that for some reason. <coughs> Doesn't like that either. Or that. Mm -hmm. Hold on. I think I threw it off by adding YouTube.com. Tesla cam wham some shit like that hold on you're right here oh it was with two A's wham bam Tesla cam well anyways <coughs> <coughs> I uh, watch a lot of these videos um, and um, pretty much <sighs> mm, my <clears throat> my boss was telling me um, yesterday that these smart vehicles <coughs> he's saying that <coughs> they that they um, <coughs> you know the people crash he, he was saying that people crash um, these Teslas crash in, in back of um, like rear end other vehicles <clears throat> you know but but with 
wham bam Tesla cam. I've actually seen it where um where the Teslas actually stop behind the vehicle and then another vehicle comes and <clears throat> rear ends the Tesla. And anyways, so I was telling them, but you know what? I believe that these smart cars should have the common sense to swerve out of the way, um, especially if there's enough time <clears throat> um, and if it's obviously like legal to do it and safe, um, then I think that um, it should veer out of um, out of danger. <clears throat> um, okay, so let's say um, a vehicle stopped or whatever, like really, really fast, and the Teslas have they have um, like sensors, so they know that they can get out the way, they can swerve out the way. So, um, so if, if it, um, po no, if it, um, detects <clears throat> any type of threat to, to itself, I think that it should be able to protect itself by swerving out the way, because they claim <clears throat> that these, um, that these Teslas, travel I mean they can go from zero to like I think it was 65 miles per hour so <clears throat> if that's really the case then it shouldn't have a problem you know swerving out of danger <coughs> um You know, and things of, of um, that nature. Like, what I can see is... <clears throat> a Tesla on the, on the fastest lane. All the way to the left. Here in the United States of America. And... Um, <clears throat> um, if... There's a vehicle coming right behind it, and another vehicle stopped, and the the sensors detect the car to the right of it. Well, obviously, it's not going to endanger other people. Okay, so it it won't slam into the other vehicle to avoid, you know, getting into a collision. Because <clears throat> that just um, would defeat the purpose. But if the shoulder is clear, um, then then yeah, maybe it can um, go in there. Especially if the AI, you know, technology or software um, that is. <clears throat> like um, programmed or downloaded into the vehicle you know that's downloaded into it um, it, it, it just will know it will know without a benefit of a doubt if if the vehicle behind it poses any type of threat towards it and if so um yeah it would just swerve out the way <clears throat> um <coughs> I think this also should include um 
vehicles that um g like get too close to the Tesla or any smart car <clears throat> all right um and they should you know have the common sense to slow down or to switch lanes or whatever the case may may be or might be especially when it is in the self driving um you know option or feature <coughs> whenever <coughs> whenever it's on um like autopilot because <clears throat> obviously <clears throat> obviously the driver doesn't you know the driver's not really aware uh, possibly the driver could be looking straight ahead and is not knowing anything about its its blind spots um, you know <clears throat> as a driver so, if there's a vehicle coming and hits it, you know, it's not really a smart car then, because <clears throat> it's not swerving out of the way, it's not accelerating or slowing down to avoid getting hit. Um... And I guess, you know, possibly with sentry mode, if any, <coughs> if any vehicles um, or, or drivers do this on purpose to cause a smart vehicle to either slow down or accelerate or to ch you know change lanes <clears throat> um, it will um, make a note of the of the vehicle <clears throat> because if it wasn't for this technology that that um that just prevented an accident um You know, in this little story that I'm telling you guys, or um, in this video. So, yeah, I think that it should um, report um, other drivers if they're going around doing that on purpose. Um, but I believe that... <clears throat> Uh, in the future and I know for certain that in the future th these uh, smart vehicles will somehow be connected to one another um, and and uh, <clears throat> they'll they will be somehow self-aware that there's other uh, you know um, vehicles um, right alongside them or behind them or in front of them and um, pretty much <coughs> pretty much <coughs> they will communicate um, 
with each other um, and um, they will um, <coughs> they will they will know exactly the computers will know exactly where these vehicles are it will, it will have a like a mental um, notes like it will be mapped out on the GPS and um, so if someone that's driving a smart vehicle <clears throat> attempts to attempts to drive into another um, smart vehicle so they're changing lanes but there's a smart vehicle here um, the, the, the vehicle will not allow the obviously the um, the driver from It, it, it just won't allow the driver to <clears throat> to uh, go into that lane because um, you know that's obviously the the whole purpose of um, what I'm talking about. It, it's for these vehicles to. <clears throat> to be smart on the road and to um, detect threats, possible threats towards them, uh, towards themselves, you know. <clears throat> and, you know, obviously maneuvering out the way um, as quickly as possible. And as safely as possible, as to avoid an accident. And obviously, if there is objects on either side, the safest thing for the vehicle to do will be to stop and allow the vehicle behind it to crash into the Tesla. But that that's like the <clears throat> the. The last case scenario, um, I think that, it, you know, it's obvious I'm basically proposing for the developers of these smart vehicles and, and their driving capabilities to program them as well to to swerve out of, out of potential danger. And... <coughs> And I think that, I think that, um, with some of these videos that I've been watching, um, the, um, you know, that software, that, that logic has not been programmed into these vehicles and it's obvious that sometimes at times that sometimes um, it is so obvious that they haven't you know downloaded this logic into <clears throat> um, the smart vehicles. Um, and you know, these people that are buying these, uh, Teslas, you know, from what I understand, uh, because we can go to the, the Tesla, just Tesla, um, store. <coughs> and, uh, <coughs> and right here. It says uh, order now. I can I can actually click on it, and then I think it's going to give me options 
as far as um or in regards to like if I want to um have other upgrades to it or not <clears throat> see like right here you know there's the long range rear wheel drive for 29,000 close to 30,000 and if we round up and then um <clears throat> there's other ones performance all wheel drive at um 42,000 so so yeah and then it says include include estimates I think and estimated incentives of 7500 and five year gas savings of 5000 for California <laughs> uh, and then there's uh, the colors <coughs> you know the the wheels um, oh, and then this is the full self driving supervised. Your car will be able to drive itself almost anywhere with minimal driver intervention. <coughs> full self driving, um, that costs, um, $8,000. <coughs> And um, there's a bunch of other things. Oh, right, right here, accessories, <coughs> center co console trays, all weather interior liners, roof rack, um, and then there's um. <clears throat> I, I you know I, I personally thought that that um, they had other um, things to add to the vehicles um, for instance I know that um, the um, cyber trucks <clears throat> they are bulletproof so um you know that's that's an extra feature that's an extra cost that could potentially in the future be applied to these vehicles as well <clears throat> so right here it will say you know do you want fucking you know the you know bulletproof um bodied armored uh technology on your vehicle and you can select it just like it's like just like this you know I think <clears throat> why is oh, okay so I just selected it right here for full self-driving supervised and it and it actually increased the the price there just like that so if you guys want um you know other stuff um you guys can obviously add it <clears throat> and then obviously you guys can do more um but um but yeah i think you know when, when my friend was um telling me about these vehicles rear ending other vehicles you know that 
He was saying that the Teslas are rear-ending other vehicles. But they probably don't have this, um, like, full self-driving um, <clears throat> um, feature. Um, so it's either that or they're freaking so broke that their sensors break <clears throat> and um they're un they're unable to fix them that or they're they're disabling certain parts certain um connections it, and it's possible if you know there's people <clears throat> working together and they know exactly what they're doing they can easily you know modify and alter the way that a Tesla has been programmed. Um, now, e even if... <clears throat> even if they have to override... Anything that... That the Tesla manufacturers or developers have have programmed the vehicle to to, to not operate or function unless these problems are corrected You know, A, B, C. <clears throat> so, um, I mean, it, it, to me, it, it just doesn't make sense if Teslas are doing that because they have they have been programmed um, to to um, <clears throat> to react faster than any human because of the sensors you know because they are attentive to their driving as long as the vehicle is on or whatever right but a driver can get distracted a driver um, <clears throat> a driver can actually you know they can start messing around with their with their, um, you know, I don't know, maybe their cell phones or their center console <clears throat> or, um, or maybe they're yelling at their children at, you know, in the, in the, ve or in the very back, um, you know, so... <coughs> So whatever the case may be, and, and it just takes you know seconds. It just takes a few seconds for um, for for an accident to happen. So. Um,
So yeah, like I think that I don't. I don't think that. <clears throat> It should, the you know, the Teslas or any smart vehicle, I don't think they should um, exceed the speed limits. <coughs> I don't think that they should, you know, obviously, um, I already said, endanger other drivers other vehicles <clears throat> because the whole purpose is for the vehicle to protect itself um, and then and then somehow going about this so that it doesn't it doesn't appear so obvious what the Teslas are doing So for as as far as other drivers are concerned, it would it would just appear like another driver. It won't, you know, um, over exaggerate things. It won't, it, you know, it won't be like, oh my god, look at that Tesla swerving out the fucking way, and. Um, <clears throat> causing a lot of attention and distractions t towards and to other drivers okay it will just be a matter of you know getting out the way and e even if it's doing it in an emergency situation but right after um, <clears throat> blending in and going with the flow of traffic like the California driver's hand handbook states it says to go with the flow of traffic and there's many reasons why but if you guys <clears throat> received your driver's license, it's to avoid, um, you know, potential um, accidents and 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 also um, is very distracting in in many ways and. <clears throat> For those of you who study um, car accidents, car cases, and things of that nature, you know, you people know more than I do, um, and I'm pretty sure you guys can even <clears throat> share stories or examples to people. Stating things like, "Yeah, it's so it's so true." Um, you know, it could be a uh, <coughs> it could be a freaking a driver going super slow on the fast lane, and everyone is going around that vehicle. I don't know, and the and then the person can say something like, um, you know, and two vehicles were merging into that lane from either direction, and um, it caused an accident or whatever the case may be, because people are, um, you know, they're. They want they want to go somewhere. They want to get somewhere. There's a slow vehicle. They're trying to go around it, <clears throat> and because they are, now it just caused an accident by two vehicles merging into the same lane. 
you know, and it, and it's happening very suddenly, very fast. So, <clears throat> there's just no time to um, to react other than uh, other than you know a press of the brakes and to try and attempt to swerve out the way, but even then. <clears throat> Um, you know, people are doing the this type of um, stuff in in vain, kind of. You know, like to no avail. I mean, yeah, it helps out a little bit, but um, not as as um, reliable as as the smart vehicles with the sensors and stuff like that. Um, <clears throat> you know, so there, there's a ton of things to to consider, especially um, for future updates when it comes to the self-driving uh, software, <laughs> because you know. These companies are not effing around. They want to remove the steering wheel altogether from some of these vehicles. <coughs> so... You know, that's why I'm taking the time to to record this video. Um, <coughs> because I think that is super important. Um, you know, and I think that for the most part, freaking in these videos with the Wham Bam Tesla Cam um, YouTube channel, um, <clears throat> I think that the majority of these accidents are from 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 other non-smart vehicles. You know, and the uh, and the reasons are obvious. <clears throat> so yeah, I just wanted to just say these few things. But um peace out everyone. Um basically over and out. Peace out.